There are hidden settings deep inside the system that control how your CPU, GPU and memory work during gaming. Most people never touch them, but that's where real performance is hiding. In this video, I'll show you how to unlock that hidden power. Every tweak you're about to apply is tested and focused on one goal, to make your PC give full attention to your game. If you want better response, smoother gameplay and more FPS, this is where you start. Let's dive in. What's related with the lag and hyping while you play games? So guys, you need Gear Booster. This is the ultimate tool to lower your ping, boost stability, and give you zero lag. Pro players like Asian Jeff and Polarized use it to stay ahead. So why not you? Download Gear Booster now from the link in the description and dominate every match. Before we jump into the manual steps, here's a helpful shortcut that can save you time and effort. If you'd rather skip the step-by-step -step tweaking process, you can download my pre-configured registry tweaks pack directly from the official website. Simply head over to uptopacks.com. You'll find the direct link in the video description. On the homepage, click the FPS Boost tab from the top menu. Scroll through the listed packs until you see the thumbnail and title that match this video. Once you spot it, simply click it and the download will start right away without any waiting. Once you've downloaded the pack, open the folder and navigate to the registry section. Inside, you'll find all the tweaks already set up and ready to apply. Just double click each file, confirm the prompt and the optimization will be automatically added to your system. The real strength of this pack is its flexibility. If you ever want to undo any of the tweaks, I've included a revert folder that contains all the default settings. Simply double click any file from that folder and it will restore the original registry values. You'll also find a text file inside with every registry path used, which is perfect if you prefer to manually apply or verify each tweak one by one. So, if you want to optimize quickly and safely, download the pack and take the shortcut. If you're someone who enjoys full control and prefers to apply everything manually, don't worry, I've got you covered. Let's dive into each tweak step by step with full explanations and guided instructions to help you get the best performance out of your PC. First registry tweak, prioritize foreground applications with Win32 priority separation. When you're gaming, you want every bit of your system's processing power focused on your game, not wasted on background tasks. By default, Windows tries to balance CPU usage between active apps and background services, but games, especially modern ones, demand real-time performance. This tweak forces Windows to give more CPU time to the active foreground application, your game, while limiting how much power background apps can consume. This results in smoother frame delivery, reduced latency, and a more stable gameplay experience, particularly if you tend to multitask while gaming. If you're running Discord, music players, or Chrome tabs in the background, this change ensures your game always comes first. To apply this tweak, start by opening the registry editor. Copy the first registry path from the video description and paste it into the address bar at the top of the editor. Press enter to go directly to the target location. In the right hand panel, locate the entry named Win32 Priority Separation and double click on it. In the window that appears, set the value data to 26. Make sure the base is set to hexadecimal and click OK to confirm. With this change, your system is now optimized to focus on what matters most, your gameplay. Second tweak, minimize input lag with max pre-rendered frames. In high-speed competitive games like Counter-Strike 2, Fortnite or Valorant, milliseconds make all the difference. The quicker your inputs register on screen, the better your reaction time and aim accuracy. By default, Windows or your GPU driver might render several frames ahead of what you actually see to ensure smoothness, but that pre-rendering adds delay between your actions and the result, creating a small but noticeable input lag. By limiting the number of pre-rendered frames to just one, you can significantly reduce this lag. The result is a more responsive gaming experience where your actions feel more immediate and precise, ideal for serious players and esports enthusiasts. To apply this tweak, copy the second registry path from the video description and paste it into the address bar. Press enter to navigate to the correct registry location. On the right side, look for a key named Max Pre-Rendered Frames. If it doesn't exist, 
right click on an empty space in the panel, go to new, then select DW ORD 32 bit value and name it exactly as shown. Once it's created, double click on it, change the value data to one, set the base to decimal and press OK. With this tweak active, your system is better tuned for low latency gameplay. Third tweak, release reserved CPU power with system responsiveness. Windows is designed to hold back about 20% of your CPU's performance for background services. Things like automatic updates, indexing or telemetry processes that constantly run behind the scenes. While this is great for general system health, it becomes a bottleneck when gaming, especially on CPUs that are already mid-tier or budget level. Reducing this background CPU reservation allows your game to access more raw power, resulting in smoother gameplay, better multitasking and fewer stutters in CPU heavy situations. This tweak is particularly valuable in open world games like GTA 5, Warzone or massive RPGs where AI, physics and background calculations are constant. To unlock that extra CPU headroom, copy the third registry path from the description and paste it into the address bar. Hit enter to jump to the correct location. Locate the key named system responsiveness and double click it. Switch the base to decimal and change the value data from the default 20 down to 10. Click OK to save the setting. You've now reclaimed 10% more CPU capacity for gaming, instantly improving overall system reactivity under load. Fourth tweak, disable core parking to fully unleash your CPU. Core parking is a feature in Windows that disables certain CPU cores when they're not in use to conserve power and generate less heat. While this might be useful on laptops or during idle sessions, it's counterproductive when gaming. Many modern games use multi-threading, meaning they spread tasks across all available CPU cores. If some cores are parked, your game ends up doing more work on fewer threads, leading to performance drops, inconsistent frame rates, and input lag. Disabling core parking ensures that all CPU cores remain active and ready for use at all times, significantly boosting performance in demanding or heavily threaded titles. To apply this optimization, paste the fourth registry path from the video description into the address bar. Press enter. Once you're in the correct location, look at the right hand side and find the key named attributes. Double click it and change the value data from one to zero then click OK. This will unhide the processor performance core parking options inside your power plan settings, which you can later set to 100% active to keep all cores awake and performing. From low-end quad cores to high-end Ryzen CPUs, this tweak ensures no processing power goes to waste. Tweak number five, deep prioritization. Tweaks for gaming with multimedia scheduler. This final step is the most advanced and perhaps the most powerful. Windows has a hidden multimedia scheduling system that determines which types of applications get priority access to CPU and GPU resources. By default, this system is optimized for a balanced user experience across video playback, browsing and productivity tasks, not gaming. By manually tweaking these values, we can push your game to the front of the line. It tells Windows, hey, prioritize this application, it's time to game. This improves everything from frame pacing and load times to system responsiveness during heavy scenes. It's especially effective if you stream, record or multitask while gaming. To apply these changes, copy the last registry path from the description and paste it into the address bar. Press enter. In the right hand panel, ensure that the following six registry values exist. Double click on affinity and set its value to F, hexadecimal. After that, double click on background only and set its value to false. Now, double click on GPU priority, now set its value to E, hexadecimal. Now, find priority, double click on it and set its value to six. Now, double click on scheduling category, set its value to high. Lastly, find SFIO priority, double click on it and set its value to high. If any of these entries are missing, right click on an empty space, choose new, then select either string value or DW word, 32 bit value, depending on what's needed. 
Name each one exactly as shown, then double click each entry to input the correct value. These changes tell Windows to treat your game like a high priority task, giving it preferential access to system resources. Once applied, you'll notice fewer background interruptions, smoother frame delivery, and more consistent performance, even under heavy multitasking or streaming loads. So guys, with all these registry tweaks applied, your system is now fine-tuned to dedicate more CPU and GPU power to your games. These are safe and reversible optimizations. Your games should now feel snappier, more responsive, and much more stable across the board. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next one. Peace out.